EA have released Musiala. Now, before we go into how to grind this, let's go ahead and tell you how much this SBC is coming in to complete it. And heading over to the trusted foot bin, you can see here it's coming in about 500,000 coins. So it's not crazy expensive. He is there for 27 days, but I don't know how I feel about this card in my opinion. I really like Musiala in game. He's got five star, four star, really good card overall. But 500,000 coins to put in a card that's... He's had an upgrade, of course he has. And he's been in fire form in real life. But he's a plus one in terms of his overall. Let me have a look at his in-games quickly. So you can see here, he's had a plus two on pace, a plus four on shooting. His stats look like okay, but I don't know if that's worth 500k. Like, how much is the gold card on the market? It's got... Can't be that much. Yes, well, must have, this is my issue. He's about 14k, like... I get it. If you run in a, a Dortmund team, sorry, a Bayern Munich team, not Dortmund. Uh, yeah, he's a great card, but nonetheless, you're not interested in that. Let's get into how to grind this. Now, we need to get ourselves an 87 rated team, an 86, two 86 teams, an 85, an 84 of a team of the week, an 84, a Bundesliga 83 team of the week, an 82 with a team of the week, and then a German player 83. So the first three squads are quite easy to grind. Now, at this minute in time, there are no upgrades out except for the default gold upgrade, which you see underneath my camera now. This one here is the only one to do apart from the league SBC. So if you are looking to grind this, you will want to wait till Monday. Today's Friday. Monday's going to be the day. Now, if you don't want to hear what's coming out, go ahead and skip just to give you a warning. But what is coming out is the 81 plus combo. So basically, we're going to get 181 rated card or higher and then a 77 plus rated card or higher. I'm going to do how to grind that when that does come out. But to get yourself started, you're going to want to have a look, as like everybody says in almost all these videos at the moment, the League SBCs. They are going to be your best friend to do. So today I wanted to introduce you to Eldorado.gg. It's a fantastic website to get yourself some FC25 coins. If you're looking to improve your team, it can take up to a matter of 30 minutes and the coins will be deposited into your account. Not only this, they have trusted and verified sellers. So you are buying off somebody else who has the coins available and it has their delivery time and their review rating of how reliable and fast they are and 100% guaranteed money back or refund if you are not happy or satisfied with your order. On top of this, they have over 34,000 positive to excellent reviews on their website. So you know these are one of the best places to go. Don't forget to use code NANIC to get your discount on your coins. The link will be in the description and in the comment section down below. Let's get back to the video. Now I get this question all the time. I'm always stuck on this Libertadores and Sudamericana. The best way to do this is to do what I'm about to show you in a second. But first, I'm just going to show you the cards that I have in my club that I can go ahead and complete. So we got ourselves the highest rated ones. Now, straight away with Libertadores in particular, there is a lot of River Plate cards. So you can only use one from one team. So we've got the 83 raid. Acuna is the must need for this SBC if you want to get this one done. And then the second one, we're going to head down to the Sudamericana because there are more goals. You can see here, we got ourselves three golds and a lot of silvers. So you can actually get this done with three golds and a load of silvers. But of course, you need higher rated silvers. Now, another issue I have is we're on Sudamericana. You can see right there. But when we search, we have ourselves a couple cards that fit into the situation. But the chemistry can be a bit of a headache. But I wouldn't worry about chemistry too much because most of these players are from Argentina. And you can just get the chemistry that way anyway. But the issue we have now is you're going to need a lot of high-rated silvers. Not just silvers in general, high-rated silvers, which are harder to come by because of how the Libertadores is in particular. We've got ourselves a silver, but again, it's from River Plate. So if I were to put all these gold or bronzes in... They are a way of doing it, but again, you need the best rated goals to get this done. So my point being with this SBC in particular is you don't want to do this SBC until you are missing like three or four players. Kind of like what I'm doing here. So you can see here, I'm probably going to be 72 rated. So I'm just off. So there are several things I can do with this. I can go to the Libertadores, for example, hit this up to concept and have a look at the highest rated cards. For example, this guy here and we've got this guy here. And we can add them in to see if that help us with the rating. Now, depending on how many goals we need, we can actually go ahead and do this now. So you see there, we're one rating off. So it looks like we're going to need two goals by the looks of it. So there you go. So you can go out and buy those two goals because everybody else here is first owner apart from Acuna that I bought. But you can see here, there, that's the way to do it where you need to buy three players. Once you've got the three players, you can continue on and basically go ahead and grind this SBC. But you can see here... Golds are not cheap. The cheapest you can probably get them is around release time. Oh, okay, 3.4 is getting cheaper. But that's going to be how you do this here. So I'm trying to do this live on the fly here. It looks like 3.4 is going to be the price. So as long as you're not paying any more than like 4,000 coins for these two golds, 
or three golds, then it's acceptable to do it. If you're paying 5,000 coins each card, it's not worth doing. So we've actually got that complete in the video. Very lucky there. But how I've got myself in this position is by grinding a certain SPC over and over. So I'm not going to talk about this league SPC anymore on this one. Talk about the mix. Now, the mix is easier to do. It doesn't cost as much, and you can get these all done. The Libertadores and Sudamericana one, you just need six players from the same club, and then you can just put in anybody you want. The MLS and the EFL one, the championship, is only three goals minimum, but there's so many goals for these, you can get them done. So what you want to do is just grind through all of these over and over and over. They don't give you the best packs back, but once you complete all of them, you do get yourself a guaranteed 82 rated or higher from this pack here and that pack you see there is the exact same pack you get for completing the Premier League and La Liga just in case you know now if you want a deep dive on how to complete these properly I have done a video on it I'm not going to go into depth with it I'm just going to explain it because I'm waiting till Monday for the upgrades to come out there isn't too much to tell you how to grind this as of now so we've gone ahead and got this pack from the Libertadores and Sudamericana and this is how you're going to want to break down the packs you're going to break it down into upgrades and league SBC so for example this is a upgrade. Sorry, that's a League SBC, League SBC, League SBC, League SBC. Upgrade. We've got ourselves a Silver Libertadores card, which is fantastic to go back around. High rated as well. Upgrade. League SBC, League SBC, League SBC. And then we've got ourselves two more League SBC. Well, one more League SBC and one more upgrade card. Now, if you don't know what an upgrade card is and what a League SBC card is, I'll break it down to you very, very simply here. A League SBC card is any of the leagues you see here on your screen right now and include on top of that any other league you see on this. Now, if you break those packs down every single time that way, you can basically get these done all the time. Now, your upgrade cards are going to go into the gold upgrade or the upgrade that comes out on Monday that I mentioned, that I mentioned in the, the don't miss out the leak part. And if you're not sure still, I understand, what you are going to do is just set this to low to high and you want to go through your club and basically get rid of all of the players that are upgrade cards. So what I'm going to do now is is just go ahead and get rid of these cards. Now, you can just use commons if you want to. It doesn't have to be gold rares. But for the sake of this video, we're just going to do that. So let me go ahead and complete this SBC, and I'll show you which players I've submitted and why. And I'll be back once that's done. So we have got this set up. Now, every single card you see here is an upgrade card. That means none of these go into any of the league SBCs. Now, a really quick way to do this is uh, all of the women cards don't be used for league SBCs, so they're all upgrade cards. So if you wanted to grind this now, that's going to be your best way of doing it, breaking down every single pack into upgrades and league SBCs, and you go ahead and submit them that way. But as always, if you do have any questions, comment down below, and I'll just show you my club very, very quickly, just to show you what SBCs I have completed, which ones I haven't. So we've got Rafinha done. Everybody you see here is first owner from either doing the grind or rewards from Foot Champs, etc. We've got Doku from one of the upgrade SBCs, and we've got Torre here from our ultimate team, sorry, from our uh, weekend league rewards. But again, we've got Alaba, Morgan, Swanson done. We've got Suzuka done. Fallan was from the Hero SBC. Varan was done. And if I show you what's in my club, as well you'll probably see if we turn the loans off for a second you'll see here that we got harlan done rutten's done the two heroes you see are from champs and the sbcs i got cliver twice and i'll show you that in a second palmer's bun kavatskili has been done so i have been completing all the sbcs as we go through the ones that i want to do like i say i'm probably not going to do musiala to be honest i don't think it's worth it in my opinion if you want to do it, that's how you go to grind it. And just to show that I have got a duplicate Cliver from the Icon SBC that came out. If we go to any SBC here and we go over to our storage, it's absolutely wrong that this is in my storage. But you can see there, <laughs> we've got a Cliver in our storage. So if you want to use that, we can as well. As always, if you have any questions, comment down below. And if you're new to the channel, smash the like button, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.